Our new production of The Nutcracker is set in Hong Kong in the early 20th century. It's a celebration of Hong Kong history and culture and Hong Kong's natural beauty. Uh, it's very special because it's about us. The first 20 minutes of The Nutcracker is uh, set in a Christmas Eve party. Uh, the protagonist, Clara's parents, are giving a, a, a glorious celebration for their friends and family. And we've set this in Kam Tong Hall, beautiful mansion built in 1914 on Castle Road and Kane Road in Mid-Levels. Um, it's the location that's now the Dr. Sun Yat-sen Museum. After the party, Clara falls asleep and dreams, and she dreams through time. So the, what happens after that is a kind of fantasy um, with bits of Hong Kong culture woven through the whole production. Uh, the Menacing Rat King is based on the famous 18th century pirate Chum Po Chai, and he appears on a junk uh, with his collection of pirate rats. All the divertissements of Act Two have been adapted to reflect some element of Hong Kong culture. For example, the Spanish divertissement becomes a dance for five peacocks from the Hong Kong Botanical Gardens. The Chinese divertissement is a depiction of the Chung Chao Bund Festival. The Russian dance becomes a lively dance for jockeys from the Hong Kong Jockey Club. This production of The Nutcracker is several things. It's certainly a celebration of Hong Kong's history and culture and natural beauty. But it's also a coming of age story of a little girl named Clara who goes through a journey and which helps her become a woman. And in doing so, she learns how to retain her childlike wonderment about the world. I also hope audiences are inspired by the spirit of the holidays, uh, by the spirit of giving, and by the spirit of joy and love. <laughs>